Hi, uh, my name is Ali Ragab. I'm from Cairo, Egypt, and I play for Halifax Prep. I started playing basketball. I was 14 in my home country, Egypt, and um, uh, I started playing on a club team, which was usually mostly in summer. And uh, one coach just saw me playing soccer for fun, and then he recruited me for the, for the first time. He taught me basics in basketball. At the same time, I immigrated to Canada. First impression of Ali, um, obviously a big seven footer. Uh, you really don't find that uh, a lot, especially in Nova Scotia. So definitely interest right away. Um, talked to him, very, very positive kid. Um, spoke well, um, very genuine. Uh, that definitely attracted me. Uh, I, always, I always look for high character kids who come to our program. A very, very hard worker on, in the classroom, you know, always has a Good, great grades. Uh, you're never gonna have to tell him to go to class or, you know, tell him to go harder. Uh, he always tries his best. Um, you know, obviously, again, uh, understanding the game that he knows that his strength are rebounding, screening, uh, be there for his teammate, help side defense. You know, he's he's definitely a special, special big man. Um, and I think he's gonna do really great in his life, not just on the court but off the court as well. So well, this year. Uh... Uh, compared to last year, I feel like I can set harder screens now using my body and uh, helping my teammates get open. And uh, I can also get a decent amount of rebounds and blocks. And uh, also this year, the change is that I became more vocal. I'm more confident to say stuff and help my teammates out. My biggest strengths in, on the court are uh, my, my position. I'm really big in my position. Uh, it's obviously height and weight too. I can push players decently easy in the post. Uh, my 100% of my game is in the post. The only shot I sh shoot is literally the free throw. And uh, yeah, that's my game. You know, you know, as a big, as myself, as a coach, uh, I understand those things that doesn't show in the stat sheet. Um, you know, deflecting, you know, uh, the, the shot, which is not a block, but the fact that he's there, you know, um, an offensive player might think twice how he wants to shoot the ball. Um, saying ball screen doesn't reflect on the stats. Um, yelling and helping on help side, again, doesn't reflect on the stats. So those little things really that he brings to the table that, you know, um, not everybody sees it, but, you know, obviously a real coach will see those values. This year, he took on a different role. Um, you know, he's starting, um, he's more vocal, be there for his teammate, uh, rebound better, um, set screen very, very hard. And at his height, with his height and his weight, it's very hard for guards to, you know, trying to go around screen, which is very important for any, any, on any kind of level. You want to have a big who can set a good screen and you know, get you open. So those things that he definitely brings to the table. Uh, I need to work on um, getting better still in my position, the center position in the post. Uh, but also get a little bit of a shot inside, like at least a mid-range. I also want to work on my hook shot in the post, especially my weak, my weak hand, because uh, I feel a lot better, like 90% good shooting with my strong side hand. I think he's a really um, coachable player because um, he listens. Um, you know, especially with me, you know, every time you say something, or any coaches, uh, for that matter, he listen. Even if you're a teacher, he tries. He, he, he definitely tries to work as hard as possible. I mean, the kid only started playing basketball only three and a half years ago. So he has a lot of, a lot of work to do, a lot of things to learn. But he's willing to learn and, you know, to improve. And, and I think it's going to come with time. I think I'm really coachable because the, from compared to the last years, this year I'm a lot better. So I'm feeling like when I work hard, I get better really fast. If a coach recruits me, uh, they will be getting a player with high intensity and uh, the, the, the wanting to get better. And uh, I'll be doing hard work. They'll be getting a, a good player in the center to still complete my, my, uh, my career of student athlete. And um, in, the, in both sides of it, in the, in the education and the, the sport of basketball, so on the education side, I want to get a good, good diploma at a good school because I've always been an honor student and uh, I, I take care of my classes and, uh, and grades. And uh, on the other side for basketball, I, I want to get coached by coaches who will uh, improve my, my skills and that will make me a better player in the future.
I see him. I see Ali playing at you know probably low major, um, maybe even mid major if he, if he loses a little bit of weight and again gain, gain his IQ level. Um, and obviously throughout Canada, I think he definitely will be able to find a spot too. And the reason why I think that is because um, you know he's a seven footer. Uh, he's three hundred and you know fifteen pound, twenty pound, um, and he can screen. Um, again, he's supportive. He's always talking. Uh, he can rebound. Uh, and those things, you know, the, for a big guy, you, you're always going to need it for, to a team.